He couldn't know that at this very moment, people meeting in secret all over the country were holding up their glasses and saying in hushed voices, To Harry Potter, the boy who lived. <laughs> Platform nine and three quarters. Nine and three quarters. I think you're being funny. I think it just started. <laughs> I'm not really sure. Uh, once people started reading the first book, it just began to spread like wildfire. I believe it was first published in England, but then Scholastic Press here, which is a very popular press for kids, picked it up and uh, people just started it and couldn't put it down. So by word of mouth, I think it started. Harry Potter series first came out. I mean, it was a rage. There was people you had to stand in line to get to get a, a copy. Um, <clears throat> and uh, and then when the movie came out, which is another question there, um, the, it, it kind of boosted circulation again because either people wanted to read, you know, return to the book after seeing the movie, or hadn't read it yet and they decided they wanted to read it. Uh, I think the recent movies have really helped um, increase the popularity of the books because people who go and see the movies realize that it, the movies are so much fun um, and that the characters are so very interesting that they want to uh, read more about them. So I think that they do really increase the popularity of the books. Give it here, Malfoy, or I'll knock you off your broom! Is that so? Have it your way, then. Harry Potter books have been banned. Um, even locally, they have been banned. And I believe, in a sense, this really increases the popularity of the book rather than um, increasing the book burnings. If something is a little forbidden, people may be more interested in finding out about it. And I think that, generally speaking, book banning does increase the popularity of the book. You know, a cultish kind of thing, uh, having to do with the occult, because it had to do with witchcraft and 
you know, which is a lot of times associated with a negative thing, which is so. But I think the controversy actually helped to <laughs> and sometimes those kind of things help to encourage the circulation of something. Since the Harry Potter books are becoming increasingly um, dark as they continue on, it may be that by the end, the Harry Potter series will no longer be for children. It may be that the forces which Harry Potter is battling against become far stronger and uh, much more dark than we have so far seen. It's very hard to tell. Uh, in a sense, I think that is, though, part of the appeal of the books. And I think children have already in those books encountered some of the darkness um, already. And to keep reading on, I think, is probably going to be interesting.